What's up everybody? Just wrapped up a video on pruning our willow tree in the winter here. We had an insane pruning on this thing. Right here it was growing, it was 15 feet tall, pruned all that up, got all of the cuttings, and now I am prepping them for propagating down in the basement. So I'll show you really quick what I did so far to those cuttings um, that will be propagating and growing. We're just gonna stick these in buckets. Basically I took the first few feet to where you know, I'm not gonna want branches once it's growing anyways. Pruned all that up nice and tight up, up against the trunk right there is another one. And then my biggest one right here, there. this is, uh, I don't know, that's, I mean, all in all, probably about like 10, 12 feet tall. And uh, yeah, we're gonna propagate this one just like the rest. I just took all the branches off the bottom we're going to stick this in a bucket right now and get these things growing. They should be growing roots in about two weeks, two and a half weeks. And I am also going to have a little bit of an experiment to see how long I can grow them in water. We do have some other willow cuttings that have been growing in water for about four weeks now at this point. I've grown willows in water for about a month and a half. But being that we're in the middle of winter right now, um, it's going to be a fun experiment just to see how long I can do this because that's what I'm all about is experimentation with the plants because if we're not having fun and if we're not growing our passion while growing these plants, then, I mean, what, what are we doing it for? Because life is all about the experiences that we have together, right? So let's go in the basement and fill up a bucket of water and toss these things in there. Oh my goodness. Don't worry, babe. Everything's fine. Oops. <laughs> hey, look at you. What happened? Can you help me with the plants? What happened? <laughs> oh boy. I scared my son. I got my pothos cuttings all over. Yeah. Do, yeah. Do you want to help? Yeah, can you put them in here? Okay, other other way? No, no, that's close enough. Good job, thanks buddy, high five. <laughs> Oops, dropped it again. All right, um, don't get pothos, they're just a never ending trap of growing too many pothos in your house. When are they going to invent cameras that just fly around and follow me? I set that up to see. Does anybody know an easy way to get two buckets apart? Seems like a recurring issue. So if you know, besides, you know, drilling holes for the air to get through, comment down below. How do you get buckets apart that are stuck together? Because... I can't do it, so I guess we're using two buckets. Now, any old water will do, tap water, whatever. If you got really, really bad chlorination problems, maybe let it sit for 24 hours, but willow trees are almost indestructible, so you'll be fine. All right, can you, can you turn the water off? Turn it off. Good job. Thank you. Another high five. We already did, dear. I like her. Let me know if you appreciate the candid look of today's video. This this is just full out Ripley personality right here. No script, no shots, no fancy editing, no nothing. This is just the way I operate. And um, I hope it goes to display my passion with these plants right here. Now I gotta figure out some way to get this willow to stand up here. There, perfect. Ugh. So there is a 12 foot willow cutting. Ah! There's a 12 foot willow cutting being propagated in my basement. All we're gonna do is let this sit. The water is really not gonna get napped. <laughs> yeah, you do it too. 
Boom, boom, boom. All right, Mommy. all right, okay, no more, no more. You really shouldn't have to do any water changes or anything like that, but if the water does get gross, uh, just dump it out, put in new water. Since we're growing indoors, it's about 67, 68 degrees down here, not very warm. I don't expect a whole lot of stuff to be grown in there that we don't want to be growing. So it should be fine. I'm gonna give you an update as we grow. Um, and as this thing roots out and everything, very excited, love willow trees, super easy. That's all there is to it. I've got all kinds of videos on them, on the cuttings, propagation techniques, growing, updates for all my plants. So check out the channel if that sounds interesting to you. And um, now I've got to tend to these plants for the rest of the day and shape them up. And I've got some stuff growing down here as well. We're gonna be growing some dahlia tubers down below in these garden beds. And I need to make room for my next plant stand because we've got a new one coming from Spider Farmer. Uh, so we are basically gonna be adding a whole nother stand. Lots of stuff coming, very excited. Thank you all so much for watching today's episode. I wish you all a great, wonderful gardening adventure. If you found today's video entertaining and hopefully learned a little bit, subscribe, hit that thumbs up and comment down below on what your favorite part of the day was. Happy gardening. I'll see you in the next one.